Welcome to Mad Barn Academy's Introduction to Equine Nutrition course. My name is Dr. Chris Mortensen. We're so excited that you took the time to visit us. Our overriding goal of this course is to give you the foundational knowledge needed so you understand your horse's nutritional needs and then also support their health and well being. This knowledge will also be important for we'll be applying it in later on courses when we look at this topic in more advanced contexts. Now, who am I? Like I said, my name is Dr. Chris Mortensen. I earned my PhD from Texas A&M University, and then I was a professor at Clemson University, where I was also the state equine specialist. I then went off and I was a professor at the University of Florida for nearly a decade, where I taught many equine-related classes to hundreds, if not thousands of students, and conducted research in horses. And then some of you may recognize me that I was the instructor for the horse course through Coursera, which reached over 100,000 students from 164 different countries. So I've taught a lot of students from a lot of different backgrounds. Now, who are we at Mad Barn? To give you this course, I'm supported by a very talented team of PhDs, DVMs, and equine professionals. Our goal at Mad Barn is to make it easy for you to feed your horse. We also give back to the industry. We're funding research, developing new technologies, and providing this education. Now, you may notice this course is divided into five modules. In module one, we're gonna go back to the basics and look at our wild horses. Then we're gonna be looking at the basics of equine digestive anatomy. And that dictates a lot of how we feed our horses. And then in module two, we're gonna look at energy and protein, two very important nutrient classes. Where do horses get those in their diets and how do we balance it? Then module three, it's all about forage and haze. What are the different hay types, plant types, and what's their nutrient composition? And how do we balance that in our horse's diets? And then module four, we're gonna be looking at common scenarios. How do you feed the underweight horse, the overweight horse? What about the performance horse? If I just ride my horse a few times per week, or what if I'm training for endurance or a thoroughbred, racing around the track? What do they need? All that will be covered in module four. In module five, we'll be talking about some common health conditions that could be nutritionally based. Things like colic, laminitis, gastric ulcers. Now, what you may also notice about this course is we have a capstone activity with each module where we're gonna be encouraging you to apply what you learned to real life context. So apply it to your horses, or if you don't own a horse, create one, what's your dream scenario, and apply the knowledge so it's all in real life context for you. Overall in this course, you're gonna be building a foundation that you can use in future courses, but also use this in your day-to-day -day life. We're gonna be giving you the tools and information sources that you can use in reference so you can support your horses, not just in their nutrition, but just in their day-to-day -day care. So we're very excited to have you here at this course and let's get going.